Hello, I'm Keith Weiser, Deputy Incident Commander of the Coconut Rhinoceros Beetle Response, and today I'm going to talk to you about damage caused to palm trees by coconut rhinoceros beetle. The coconut rhinoceros beetle feeds on the uh, unemerged fronds of different types of palms. So here we have a coconut palm, and uh, when they bore into the top to feed, they cause damage to the leaflets. So in the areas that they bore, the leaflets are all bundled together in what we call a spear. So to simulate that, I have a little model here where um, all the leaflets are all bundled up together. And if I take out some scissors and I cut a little hole in here like the beetles would cause damage, and we unfurl that damage uh, like the leaves unfurl out of the tops of the trees, um, then you can see that it causes these V-shaped cuts where normally these fronds would emerge all the way to the ends. We've got this V-shaped notch in the leaves. Other types of palms, uh, fan palms that have leaves like this. So the damage looks a little bit different on that type of leaf. And so when you get a borehole in there, uh, the beetle is going in there to feed on the juices up in the top of the tree and you get this type of pattern in the leaves. So we call, uh, this is like a radial pattern where you get the holes all the way across. So uh, V cuts in coconut trees and other um, pinnate leaves and then the palmate leaves like fan palms, you get this snowflake type pattern. Hi, I'm Keith Weiser, and I'm going to show you some patterns of mustache damage that can be caused by CRB. <laughs> What's that? Oh, yeah. Uh, let me know when you guys are all set. Sure. Are you going to pop up? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm a fan pop. Perfect. That was less good.